good family and welcome back to the channel this is another video a series that i want to produce to the channel this is dragon ball z kakarot i've been a huge dragon ball fan for a very long time you know from dragon ball dragon ball z dragon ball gt and dragon ball super i still watch dragon ball to this day it never ceases to amaze me just the nostalgia of dragon ball z so when i found out that cyber connect 2 who is the same developers for the naruto storm series were developing this game i had to buy it because they have done justice to games like a source wrath you know and the naruto ultimate ninja storm and the whole storm series you know so they've done pretty good on these storm games when it comes to their story mode so they took their challenge to developing a dragon ball game and they're dedicating it to akira toriyama this whole game it's just strictly Dragon Ball Z. So I want to get into the story mode because I feel like this game is going to do justice. I feel like it's going to be a nostalgia. I feel like it's going to be a classic. But I'm not going to put my expectations too high because it is Dragon Ball. You know, Dragon Ball games today just pretty much comes and goes. But I have faith in Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I feel that this is going, this game is going to be a classic a nostalgia just like the previous games for an example dragon ball z legacy of goku 2 you can pick that game up today and still chill and have fun with it so let's get into this game this is purely from dragon ball z to the end of dragon ball where they fight majin buu so here we go man i hope you guys like it go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you do comment let me know what's your favorite dragon ball game that you can pick up today and still play you know if you're a dragon ball fan so here we go. Without further ado, let's get into this game, bro. Dad? And this Dad? game look clean too, man. Just because it look clean, it gotta play clean too. We gotta see. He must be mentally training, you know, like how they be doing on the show. You came. I like to do a little image training every now and then to make sure I don't get too rusty. Time to see what I can do. And you're just the guy to help me do that. You could come, girl. <laughs> Amber in the background, she kind of nervous because she don't want to come in the camera. It's, it's all good. <laughs> you straight. All right, let's go. We got Piccolo here and the basic controls. Uh, I guess it's okay. Let's try a little couple things. Key blast. Um, guard. Whole X to boost. Super boost. Who's that? Oh, shit. Oh, what the hell? Okay. Oh, that was sweet right there. All right. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I, I see how this is going. Oh, Piccolo, you kind of easy. Nah, man. Well, uh, this is pretty much probably having me learn the controls. I'm pretty sure it's going to be harder enemies than that. Oh, shit. Mad. Oh, he, he mad. He mad. All right. Oh shit, what the hell? Oh shit. He doing it again. Oh no, this is a different move. I'm liking this one. I like this shit. Oh, oh, oh. What the hell? Oh shit. Oh, he done for. Alright, let's go in. Hey, can I do like a command mirror or something? Wait, super attacks. Oh, he has three. Okay, we can do it. All right, so when he's down again, when he gets tired, I do it. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh. Is he tired yet? No. 
Oh wow! Dodge that boy. Damn, I gotta learn the controls. I'm just, I'm just mashing at this point. Surge. It should take damage or deal it out. Your attention gauge will fill when both your attention gauge and key are full. Hold triangle to activate the surge effect. A surge is active. All of your stats are boosted. You'll be able to perform unique attacks and cancel super attacks and combos into their actions, as well as automatically chase after knockdown opponents. The surge effect gives you the freedom to chain together attacks you normally can't chain together, as well as you do things like fire off multiple command mails one after another. Really? Okay, let's do it. It's pretty much. Okay, so do I just go in for the kill? Oh shit! Okay. Oh, he won't even let me get him. Oh shit! Okay, he mad. He mad. Oh shit! Ooh! What the hell? I can't even get him. All right, let's fire. Let's fire one of these. There we go. Oh shit! You tired? Let's do it. Oh yeah, I'm liking this game. I'm liking it. It feels like it too. Oh shit! Piccolo gives me a run for my money, even though. I'm learning the controls by fighting this guy for the first time. Oh, I got an S and a level up. This game heavily feels like Legacy of Goku 1 and 2. That was sweet. Here we go. Oh, I like that shot right there. I might use that as a thumbnail, to be honest. Story recap. The boy's son Goku defeated Demon King Piccolo, who plotted world domination. Five years have passed since his victory. Yeah, man, this game heavily feels like Legacy of Goku 2 on the handheld game game boy advance it just brought to the play, uh consoles I, I absolutely it feels like it too it feels like that action that action rpg <laughs> not much longer before this planet's ours it would have been ours much sooner if you'd actually done your job, Raditz. Uh, sorry. And that's why everyone calls you Raditz the Runt. Things will be different on the next planet. <laughs> Mark my words, if you screw up again, I will kill you. Wait, I just remembered something. I think my little brother Kakarot was sent to a different planet. I'll bet he's still there. You have a brother? I didn't think there were any Saiyans left besides us. If he joins us, the rest of the universe will be ours in no time. The fact that he's your brother doesn't exactly fill me with confidence. What planet was he sent to? Uh, I think it's called Earth. Man, they completely shits on Raditz in this game. But now you that know what? I think about it, I haven't heard anything about him taking control of it. Damn that Kakarot, what the hell is he doing? That's crazy. Ooh, I like that. Attack of the Sands. Okay. I gotta I, I gotta say this, like, throughout the whole... I don't want to spoil the family if you don't know anything about Dragon Ball Z. I don't want to spoil it for you, but they pretty much shit on Raditz on this game, man, because he's that weak. And the bald-headed guy and Vegeta, Nappa and Vegeta, absolutely Dad, way more powerful. We better head home or Mom's going to be really mad at us. Sorry for getting a bit carried away, Gohan. I was fighting somebody super strong. Super strong? 
Yeah, a guy going by the name of Piccolo. Piccolo? Yeah, well, he used to be called Demon King Piccolo, and he was real bad to the bone. He's the strongest guy I've ever fought in my whole life. I don't think anybody's gotten me more pumped up than him. I want to fight him again, so I'm hoping to get stronger and... S I'd be afraid to fight someone like that. <laughs> you know, I bet you'd be just fine if you trained yourself up a bit. I don't think Mom would like that very much. Ah, that's right! I totally forgot that Chi-Chi asked us to get some ingredients for her. How could I not remember that? Well, boy, Goku, come on, man. Your wife uh, is the most scariest you. thing on the planet, what though. What did she need again? <laughs> oh, uh, I think she wanted some fish and apples, Dad. Oh, yeah, right. Let's just see if we can't find us some apples around this place. Okay, I'll go look. Gohan sure is full of energy. Basic controls. We can use key blast even while walking. Charge key blast. Hold. Search for key. Okay, so I think I got the gist of the basic controls. Vehicles. You can drive vehicles. Vehicles. Okay, we're going to have to try that out later. We're going to have to see about that. Items on the field. You can find a variety of items on the field. Simply approach an item and you will automatically collect it. You have to press circle when near an important item. Those to collect it. Alright, so pretty much the basic stuff. I'm surprised you can <coughs> drive vehicles. Don't get too excited and trip over your own feet. Alright, so I gotta collect some apples. Okay, guys, let's talk a little quick. Fam, if you don't know anything about Dragon Ball. So pretty much his story, the whole now, Goku story. It's pretty much like Superman. You know, far. Superman. All the Kryptonians, you know, they're super strong, but their planet was doomed and they exploded. It is exactly, well, not exactly, very similar like Superman's home planet. Their planet was doomed by a villain named Frieza who just decided that the Saiyan race didn't need to exist anymore because they were getting too powerful. They were getting too strong. So he simply destroyed the planet just on a, well, he didn't destroy it on a whim. I don't want to tell you why he really destroyed it if you're not a fan of the, ser of the series. But he basically destroyed their home planet. And Goku was sent on Earth as a baby. And he has no memory of it. So he was raised by someone named Gohan. Pretty much trained him. You know how to live life. Collect everything. Let's hunt and everything like that. What do you and say? so he's been on Earth for a long time. Now his, Bradis, his brother Radis has come. Thinking that he's supposed to destroy the planet. But he's there just having a son. Living a good life. So this is going to be a hell of a turn of events for Goku, man. Alright, so we got to collect some apples for my oh, son God, here. Like he's having a blast. Where is he? Is he still following me? Okay. Hey Maybe I'll still walk so Don't I won't uh, pass him up. Well, yeah, that's basically the story. Goku was sent to Earth as a baby to destroy it. But of course, he didn't. He was a baby, he knocked, and plus he hit his head, so he has no memory of whatever he's supposed to do. He had a son, he trained with one of the masters of the world, Master Roshi. Become a great martial artist. He's living a good life. Has a son, has a wife. Now his brother has come to check on him. Dad! Over here! Over here! Wow, Gohan! You're a regular bloodhound! Alright, this ought to be enough. Oh, yeah, we've got plenty of apples now. Thanks for finding these, Gohan. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of tired now, though. I get it. And I don't blame you. Hang in there. I got an idea. We'll catch some fish and then head straight home. Okay. You know what they should have did, though, I First, feel. We need to find a spot to fish. Okay. Don't Keep walk going close. You got it. Try to keep up, though. I like this intro, though, where they bond and father and son. Well, they did do that on the first episode of Dragon Ball Z. You know what they should have did, though? They should have started from Dragon Ball, you know, to get the whole point of the story. It's Goku as a child to where he becomes a grown man and he saves the world, like, numerous times. 
So I hope this game does justice though. I really do. I really hope this game does justice. You know, I don't know the type of content that's in this game. I'm from what I hear, man. What's wrong, Gohan? It's a lot. I'm tired. I can't walk anymore. Man, you get tired pretty easy, don't you? <laughs> I guess I can carry you if you want. Hooray! Alley <laughs> Look how high I am! Hey, you perked right up. Were you trying to trick your old man? <laughs> You're one spoiled kid, you know that? It's crazy. This is exactly like so, Dragon Ball Z Lexi of Goku 2. Hmm. Um, I want to become a great scholar. What? You're a weird one, aren't you? <laughs> well, I definitely can't help you with your studies or anything like that. But if you're ever looking to toughen up, I'm your man. Nah, fighting is too scary for me. Come to think of it, this is your first time fishing, isn't it? Yep, it is. All right, then let me show you how I used to do it back when I was your age. We should be able to catch something here. All right, let's get started. But what are we gonna fish with? We don't have any rods. <laughs> Nobody said anything about a rod, did they? Who needs one of those pesky things when you've got a tail? My... my tail? I can use that to fish? Yep. By dipping your tail in the water, you can feel the fish moving around. Pretty neat, huh? It's really easy once you get the hang of it. I mean... I haven't done it in a while since I don't have a tail anymore, but when I told my friend Bulma about it, she actually made me a makeshift tail to fish with. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> nice! Oh, okay. So what do you say? Let's catch us some fish. I seen the video. He can really attach the tail to his body. <laughs> he about to attach the tail to his body. I'm pretty sure there's a good spot somewhere right around this place. That's cool though, like they put every aspect of Dragon Ball in this game. You can go fishing. This is absolutely a our action RPG, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, how do we do this? Wiggle tail. Come on, we gonna catch one? Okay. Ooh! Lean giant fish. I got two of them and a giant fish fin muscle. Damn. So are we gonna eat it or what? You got them, Dad? Yeah. I bet Chi Chi'll flip when she sees this one. Man, all this fishing is really working up an appetite. You know what I mean? Let's eat some of these fish. I mean, we got plenty. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm a little hungry too. <laughs> Let's roast our catch over the fire. What do you say? Are we really about I'm to eat this shit? Grilled fish. Cool. Okay, time to grill up some fish. Eat a meal. Eat a meal. So I'm loving this intro. They having a bond at time, father and son. Okay. A uh, lean giant fish or a giant fish fin. These look like the only two options I have. Wait, they increase your stat only by three minutes. One percent to key defense. Uh, damn. Which one would I want? They both give me the same thing. So I mean, what's the difference? Hey, yeah, what's the difference between the two? I, I really don't know. Let's do lean fish. That's crazy, man. They put, they did just the smallest details about the, the whole series is in this game. I feel like party HP and key have been completely restored. That's crazy, though. That's tough. Man, I'm stuffed. Is there anything better than some fresh fish in your belly? Ugh. I think I ate too much, though. 
Yeah, that's all we're gonna be doing in this game, man. Well, we're gonna be eating like a mug. You want to be as big as your dad? You're gonna have to eat a lot of this stuff. <laughs> right. I had fun today, Dad. You know, I had fun today too. Thanks for your help. I'll teach you how to fish next time so we can do it together. Okay. I can't wait. What the heck is this? Soul emblems received. You got the following soul emblems. All right. Soul emblems are items that represent relationships with certain characters and can be obtained as you progress through the story. All the soul emblems that you've obtained can be reviewed on the community menu. Soul emblems don't do anything by themselves, but by setting them to a community board, you can activate effects that will help you on your adventure. You got Z Warrior Community Leader Goku and unlock the new community board. So these increase my stats. Community boards are where you set your soul emblems. Emblems can be reset or removed at any time. So if you get your hands on a new emblem, don't forget to set it on the community board. To set a soul emblem to a board, simply press X. Okay. A community ranks is influenced by the overall community level of the soul emblems you have set. Once the overall community level reaches a certain value, the community's rank will increase and you will gain access to more of its community skills, which provide helpful effects. So this does boost my stats. So emblems have community levels that affect the community to which they are set. Emblems are well suited to some communities, but not well suited to others. Setting them to certain communities will increase the maximum community's level. Increasing proficiency will increase the community's level. In this community, you can activate community skills that will help you in your battle. Build up the Z Warrior community if you want to focus more on battles. Okay, so this is a pretty cool feature of the game. So I collect these emblems and put them on the board and then increase my stat. So the higher the level, the more uh, skills I unlock. All right, so we're only level three. So we should have melee attack 1%, right? I oh, know, let's try. Right, after selecting Gohan, press X. Set Gohan next to Goku. Okay. Oh, next to Goku. What? The hell? I just tried. Oh, okay. Oh no. Be pretty strong if you train. So what's the whole what's the whole stat thing? Why they three and two? I, I don't think so. The following bonus is now received. Ultimate Father Son team. Placing Pacific Soul Emblems next to each other will activate what's called a Link Bonus. Activating a Link Bonus raises a community level and makes it easier to raise a community's rank. Press the deep, press the pad to view the board. Okay. Oh yeah, Dad. That's I a pretty cool feature. You, I found this while you were fishing. I don't really know what it is, but here you can have it. Really? Thanks, Gohan. <laughs> Sacred text of martial arts. Give the item Gohan found. The soul emblem's friendship and proficiency can both be increased using gifts. Raising an emblem's proficiency will increase its community level. Community that is affected will depend on the gift given. For an example, the sacred text of martial arts item increases the level of the Z Warrior community. Friendship influences how characters perform in battle, so be sure to make use of any gifts you have. Okay, so I gotta give a gift to Goku. Z Warrior Proficiency. Oh, Z Warrior Community has gone up from one to two. Damn, okay. So that's, this is pretty cool. I, I like this feature. I feel like you got multiple ways to get stronger. Talk to Gohan. Should we head home now? And uh, let's go home. All right, let's head home. Right. So, like I said, fam, if you are new to the story, <laughs> the whole story of Dragon Ball is pretty much almost similar to Superman's. Almost. Us! Okay. Their planet was doomed. They are a Saiyan race. They are 
bloodthirsty. They love right. to fight. Hang on and tight. they get stronger <laughs> in every fight. They get stronger all the time. Majority of the uh, Saiyans have died. So Goku and Raditz, Nappa, and Bye -bye. Vegeta are the only Saiyans left. So I don't want to spoil the whole thing for you guys. I want you guys to check it out if you're not new to the story of Dragon Ball. Okay, Z Orbs. Z Orbs are special items you can find on the field or win from battles. Any you find on the field can be collected by approaching them from the side. They are essential for requiring super attacks. So make sure you to collect as many as you can. So we got to buy our super attacks with these orbs. Types of Z orbs. There are many different types of Z orbs. Orbs of certain color can be found near areas related to, uh, to that color. For an example, blue orbs can be found near water, green orbs near forest, etc. If you're looking for Z orbs of a specific color, head to a spot with that color, with a lot of that color. Okay, this is so damn cool. This is so damn cool. So collecting these Why orbs. Wait, so how do I like go down? I was just a little kid. I don't know how to go down. How to go down? Okay, wait. That's how you go down. That's how you go up. Okay, this is gonna be kind of weird getting used to the controls. But uh, I think I got the hang of it just a little bit. All right, so that's that's pretty cool. I'm I'm loving this already. It's it feels more like Dragon Ball, man. Out of all the games I played, they've all had their unique way of things. I feel like this game is gonna do justice to the story mode. I feel like the, they're gonna tell the story absolutely beautiful. In Cyber Connect 2's hands, I feel like they're gonna do it very beautiful, very cinematically. Man, I I can't wait to get to the battles, bro. Hey, Chi Chi, we're back, and we got food. Hi, mom. You're late, Goku. It shouldn't have taken you so long to gather ingredients. Yeah, sorry about that. We did some training, too. You're supposed to introduce Gohan to Master Roshi and the others today. Wait, that's today? Of course. Ah, sorry about that. I promise I'll remember next time. Forget it. What are you waiting for? Get in here. I need to get cooking right away. Cool, she about to cook us some food. And this is the whole thing about Goku and everybody else, man. They love to eat, bro. That's crazy. If you want fruit, meat, fish, or other ingredients, you can get them. You can get them cooked by Chi Chi or by other cooks. Eating cooked dishes provide special effects, such as boosts to stats and temporarily support effects. These are called meal effects. Every dish has its own list of necessary ingredients. With rich dishes requiring rare ingredients, more extravagant full course meals provide even greater effects. You can't cook them right now, but you'll be able to, to as you progress further in your adventure. So my wife about to cook us a delicious meal. You know what I'm saying, Amber? She about to go ahead and cook us something. And whip you up something tasty. <laughs> All right, make a dish, make a full course meal. <laughs> hey, honey, you ready for this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bullfish. You got bullfish. No, that's what they eating. I mean, no. What can she make us? What can she make us? Yeah, we gotta eat bullfish. Yeah, we got to. That's the only thing we can we can eat because that's the only thing me and my son made when we uh when we collected when we went fishing. No, nah, we ain't got nothing else. We ain't got nothing else. <laughs> Me and my son only collect the fish, so that's the only thing we can eat. All right, so we got boiled fish. Oh man, she about to make me cry a little bit. Uh, so this will boost my stats a little bit. So that's pretty cool, man. I'm, I'm gonna be eating a lot in this game, man. All right, let's talk to my son. I'm going to see Master Roshi, my old master. His place is surrounded by the sea. It's loads of fun. Oh yeah. All right, so we're going to Master Roshi's. Hey, what is that? Oh, they got flashback pictures to put his students to the test. Master Roshi throws a stone on which he wrote the characters for Turtle deep into the woods. He states that whoever finds the stone and brings it back first will get to eat dinner, while the others will go hungry. Goku finds the stone, but Krillin tricks him and steals it away. 
and Krillin rushes back to receive his meal, but unexpectedly, Trap is waiting for him. Yeah, that was that's flashback of Dragon Ball, man. This I like that right there. Me and Krillin used in our training. Me and him had to hunt this thing down. Krillin beat me then, but only because he cheated. I had to go hungry that night. <laughs> Z Encyclopedia. All right, so we're gonna be collecting a lot of those, man. I feel like we got a lot of stuff to do in this game, man. Right, let's go talk to my wife right here. Come on, man. She got that food waiting for us. All right, I'm finished. Tell me more. Here are your lunches. Dig in whenever you're hungry. Thanks, Chi-Chi. Your stuff's the best. It really gets the blood pumping and the muscles moving. Right, Gohan? Yeah. So we got another community board, and I'm assuming she's for the like the cooking stuff. Yep, you got the cooking community board. Okay, so this community activate community skills. Damn, this it's a lot of leveling up. Yeah, so we ain't got no cooking stuff. Nobody else that knows how to cook. So if I like put Boma or something, maybe I don't know. We got a whole bunch of things we can do, bro. Cause Goku and Gohan ain't gonna fit on that board. Later, Chi Chi. We're off to see Master Roshi. Wait a second. Are you forgetting something, Goku? I thought you had something for Gohan. Oh, yeah, that's right. Whoa, what a neat little ball. That little ball on top there? It's a dragon ball. I got it from my grandpa after he died. But that's not all you got from him. You were also named after him. Really? Oh my, Gohan looks so handsome. It'll be like he's watching over you whenever you wear that hat. So take real good care of it, okay, Gohan? Yeah, I will. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. All right, we're leaving for real this time. Goku, don't let anything happen to our little Gohan. And Gohan, be on your best behavior. I will, Mom. Bye! All right, so I we... you both home by supper, you got it? Now this is, I like the introduction. It shows how much of a family man he is, you know, with the son and his wife. He's living the life of a husband and a child. That is pretty much Goku's life right now until his brother shows up and all hell breaks loose. You know, then Piccolo, you know, finds him first. He's like, okay, what the hell is going on? This is Dragon Ball. Very slowly, though, it's going to start to expand and explode it said there are seven mystical orbs capable of granting any wish when brought together with them anything the heart desires can be attained whether unfathomable riches or absolute power these mysterious wish granting orbs are known as the dragon balls and it's around these Dragon Balls that this extraordinary story unfolds with new challenges and adventures awaiting Goku and his friends at every turn. 